Are you looking for a free tool to do a keyword research? This is the right place. Check it out. How to use a free keyword research tool? The name is Traffic Travis. Let's check out the video and give the thumbs up. Hello friends, this is Joy Banerjee from TechieWorld.in and today I will let you know a free uh, tool from where you can do some keyword research. And this is a very good tool which you can utilize and if if you are a new beginner or uh, new interpreter uh, on a on a internet world, so this tool really helps you out, right? Because we need to do some on-page SEO, which has been very important to uh, see our content over the internet, and they should be searchable. So this is this this is the tool which you really want to go with, okay? So I'll show you how to get it. You need to go to trafficrevis.com and then go for the free download. Okay, you need to put your name and the email address here. Okay. So it will uh, check out if you are uh, previously registered. Now it can see that uh, I am already previously been registered it says okay so I will uh, click here or you will click to register if you are a new user okay and it will take you to a section where you can you can uh, really download this okay so I will download uh, this application so it's about 15 MB so you can place it anywhere on your system let's say I'm placing it uh, Creating a new folder in a desktop. Okay. Okay, once it is downloaded, then I will show you how to really install it and how it looks and how to work with it. Okay, now the tool has been downloaded. So I will try to install it. I will click yes. Next. It's very straightforward installation. Look nice. Now it says installation done. Okay, I will require a registration uh, code. So let me check I have it or not. Otherwise I can re-request it from the site. Let me show you how you can do it. Okay. So we have downloaded it from here. <coughs> now I can see that it says that recent the request, registration request. If you have done it for the first time, you will get the uh, get the code in your email. And this time I will re-request it. So I will put my details here. If it doesn't work, then I need to search uh, on my email. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> it's not working. Let me check. Um, if I can check my old emails on this, okay. Okay, now you can see it is asking for the registration code. So the registration code has been sent on the email. So let me show you how it looks. So in my case, this is my registration code. I put it here and hit register. So if you are a new user, um, you will get an um, email from Traffic Travis like this and you need to activate your account. Okay. So I will click that link and it will activate your account. And after that you will get another email from them with the registration code so that you can sign up. Okay. So you can see I got two emails which says uh, a welcome email along with the registration code. Okay. So let me put the registration code 
uh, on this installation okay and then uh, click register okay now you can see I've put in the registration code and hit register now it's been setting up and checking all the things so it will give you a uh, getting started videos that uh, if you want to check okay so you can say okay let me so this is the dashboard on which you can see um, all the things uh, which will visible here so at this moment it will ask you to really create a new project okay. you will give a project name let's say take your word and also give the site URL and now you need to enter the site map and I have gathered few keywords which I need to really associate with this uh, site so let me put those okay let's say these are the demo keyword which I'm putting here okay and in the update setting um, you can uh, check out what what these are okay and uh, mainly um, just concentrate on this and click save project okay so this will uh, do a sync uh, you can see it is showing as updating process so anytime you can do some alteration because uh, I have done some uh, keywords which are being really uh, a demo keyword not exactly really belong to this uh, site okay so I will go to research and uh, I will do some uh, keyword analysis okay so in the free version you can only do a uh, 50 uh, research okay so I will put uh, the keywords like this you can see they already picked up from the project so let's say I will click OK and fetch okay. so I have not yet entered the advert account so it will ask me to really enter the advert account okay. so now I need to put my advert account So you can do a test as well, okay. So at this moment it is untested, so we can uh, do a test. And you can also get a new one uh, by clicking here. It's a free account which you can apply from Google. It gives me some issue that it has some issue. Let me check once more. What is the issue? Because it was working previously. Okay, now you can see uh, the testing is completed. It says adverse details are okay. Uh, I'm not sure what was the issue, but uh, I've logged into the AdWord account and then I've tried to uh, test it again. So it worked now. So I will click save. I will do a fetch. So this time, um, hope this will gather some keyword research. As we have uh, linked our AdWord account in this. It will take some time to really um, do the analysis because it's searching all the keywords. Okay, now you can see it is fetching some information. Okay, and it will also give you a global count and also give you a US count. What is the competition? It's high, medium. Or low okay so it will give you a average CPC okay which will give you a good understanding right and all the details so it will take some time to really complete this information okay so once it is completed then you can do uh, 
import on our Excel and do the proper filter and pick the keywords which you are looking for. So it's a very good tool to really explore with. So what I would suggest is do some exploration because I'm using it and it's really helping me out. Okay. And again, you can anytime go to the pro um, uh, pro version, right? And I, I will share the link right below uh, in the description. You can really go back to that particular link and get your copy download and test it out yourself. And hope this is uh, a great tool which you can really add into your kitty. So let me show you. Uh, now you can see once it is being completed, uh, you can really export this to PDF or CSV. The CSV is quite equivalent to uh, Excel format. So I always prefer to do it on CSV because it will give uh, me a better uh, filtration and all. So it's again your choice which, which version you want to do it. Okay, let's say I will do it on CSV. So <clears throat> I will choose the location again. So let's say keyword tool. Okay. You can put your custom name if you want. Okay. Let's say demo. So I will save it. And it will ask you, do you want to open it? So let's say open it. So these are the keywords and these are the competition and these are the CPC which you can see. Okay. You can do is select this. So you can do a quick filter, which will. Uh, okay. So you can see, uh, you can sort it. Okay. Um, from the search and how much the global search is going on, and what is the competition, and you can pick the keywords of your choice. So it's very good tool, and I will prefer you to really. Um, do test it out and the links are below and if you like this particular video give me a thumbs up and do share your views what do you think and if you, if you need more help let me know so that I can create more videos related to this which will help you out thank you very much this is Joy Banerjee from TechEvolve.com are you looking for more videos like this subscribe now and if you like this video give us a thumbs up hey have you done it? Please do it. Thank you.